now uh, we are the second part of day 3 videos questions we can say that is on combined loading so we have a hollow rectangular pier of 1.2 meter or 0.8 and overall thickness is given so now just see so we have this will be 1.2 by 0.15 sorry 1.2 by 0.8 and thickness is given 0.15 from all sides. So 0 0.15, 0 0.15, 0 0.3. So this becomes 0 0.5. And this becomes 0 0.9. So we have this will be column. Hollow column. And then given vertical load 1000 is transmitted in a vertical plane bisecting. So it is bisecting this value. And that is given on this at 0.1 meter. So we have somewhere here, 0.1 meter. And then E, we have 0.1 meter. And then you can find bisecting 1.2 meter. So it becomes depth. So D becomes 1.2 meter and B becomes 0.8 meter. And then you can find and you can calculate the values. That is maximum and minimum. Then uh, we have second uh, cast iron pillar 150 mm in diameter. So diameter is given 150 millimeters. So we have this is column with 150 mm diameter. The center of the hole, sorry, 50 mm hole is drilled along its axis. So we can consider along this axis. The center of the hole is 40 mm from the center. So from here, we have hole of this is 40 mm and has a whole 50 mm diameter. That means somewhat like this. So it will go 10 mm over here. So this will be 50 mm and center we have 40 mm. So this is 50 mm center. And this value of center we will have 40 millimeters. And load is acting at this center and value is given 1000 kilonewton. Now try to find it. Find E, then find I uh, and then calculate the remaining things. Now we have to keep in mind our origin, our Y, Y axis that is shifted. And accordingly, we have to find value of I that is of solid and that is of hollow. So now calculate this and check it. I will upload answers of this. So now we will stop here only. This will be second part of the exercise three. Now we will stop here only. Thank you.